join your hand for Jesus. Hallelujah. I want to celebrate on the topic which I tied to this morning. Do all you can to be strong in the Lord. Do all you can to be strong in the Lord. Job chapter 2 verse 1 to 11. Please follow me carefully. Job chapter 2 verse 1 to 11. Again, there was a day when the sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord. And Satan came also among them to present himself before the Lord. Amen. <laughs> Again, there was a day when, when the, the sons, sons of God, God came to present, to present themselves, themselves to the Lord. To the Lord. And Satan came also among them to present himself before the Lord. And Satan came also among them yes, to present himself, himself before the Lord. For the Lord. Before the Lord. Okay. What do you understand here? There are so many of you that ask me a question. Apostle, why am I passing through this? Why this thing is happening to me? Why is it that I'm suffering for this? Why is it that things are going bad with me? Why is it that things are not happening the way I want them to happen? I want to answer you here now. Again, there was a day, day when the, sons, when of the God sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord. No be sons of sin, no. No, sir. No be sons of Satan. No, sir. Sons of God, of God. come to present themselves before, before the, the Lord. Lord. Yes, sir. And Satan, Satan came. Came also among them. Among them. And present itself before the Lord. Before the Lord. The same way you are in church now. Satan do. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not talking to you now. The same way you are in church now. Satan do. Yes, sir. The Satan may be your neighbor. Yes, sir. The Satan may be the person sitting close to you. Telling you why you they get up the dance like that. Now look you they dance. You know, they say people they look at you. With your state, why must you dance like that? Satan may be sitting with us to you. He's among them. And here what God asked him. Verse 2. Verse 2. And the Lord said unto Satan, From whence cometh thou? And Satan answered the Lord and said, From going to and fro in the earth, and from walking up and down in it. Amen. Amen. The Lord asked Satan, Where are you coming from? He said, I have been moving through and through. I have been moving all around the earth. And I found this place that you are having an important meeting. Yes, I come here to give a distraction. Yes, Satan did not have anything good to give to you. Yes, Only thing that Satan has to give yes, is to kill, hey. to destroy. Yes, Nothing good can come out of Satan. Yes. He said, I've been moving through all that room, yes. all around the head. Yes. What do you understand by that? Yes. That means Satan is hopeless. Yes. Yes. Roaming around the yes. head. So in the era where we are living now, is the era of power. Era of power. Era where devil is moving in a new dimension. Devil is moving in the social media. Devil is moving in every platform. Yes, sir. Just to destroy the faith of the believer. Yes, sir. Devil is moving in every area. Hey. In the Facebook, devil is moving there. Yes, Satan is moving there. Jesus. In Twitter, Satan is moving there. Yes, On Twitter, Twitter, Satan is moving there. Yes, On Instagram, Twitter, Satan is moving there. Hey. So you must put on all the armor of God yes, so that ye may withstand this day. Hey. Hear this. Yes, sir. Let me explain something to you. Talk to me, sir. Wait. If you think it in a mind that as a mother, more mother here where we are please, as a mother you give back to five children, three children, four children, and you think Satan will allow all your glor your glorious children to be successful, you are the highest joker of your life. You think that you come to church one day and you cry, or you need that beside your bed, and you cry, my children will be successful. My children will be successful. And you think Satan will pity you, you are a joker. Satan is not merciful. No, sir. If Satan will pity people, there are people with him in the air, crying day and night. He has not shown them any mercy. No, sir. Satan is not merciful. 
His heart is hardened. He's not showing any mercy to anybody. You think Satan will just look at your tears? He says, "My cry, let my cry touch you in your heart, oh Lord. Let my tears touch you in your heart, oh Lord. Tears don't they touch any Satan? No, they touch. Oh, oh. In fact, now enjoy me that. Hey. Any time you are sharing tears, Satan is putting grass cup. Oh, yeah. Now your tears be his drink, be his juice. Hey. So the more you cry, the more tears Satan is happy. What is the end? Okay, okay. What is Satan going to do? To steal, yes, sir. to kill, and to destroy. And to destroy. Yes, sir. So, wait, listen to me. Immediately your son has something that Satan can destroy, Satan will come. Immediately your son has something that Satan can steal, Satan will come. Immediately your child has something that Satan can steal, Satan will come. What is your, your gate man doing? You know who is the gate man of every house? The woman of the house. He said the wings of the mother hand is a protection to the children. Yes, sir. When the mother is prayerless, there is nothing the children can, there is no year the children can get to. Angel did not appear to Joseph. He appeared to Mary. Yes, sir. He said to Mary, blessed are thou among women. Even the angel know the importance of you conceive a baby. Yes, sir. If you know the pain you pass through, you will stand to fight for that child. Yes, yes sir. sir. No child is useless. Any child that is giving you headache today, check very well. That child is the most destiny child you have. Yes, sir. Oh. What did I say? No child is useless. Yes, sir. Satan did not come to where they are in a beer palo. No, sir. Satan did not come to them in a shower quarter. No, sir. Satan did not come to die where they are in the place of unholy. No, sir. Satan come to them in the presence of God. Yes, sir. In the presence of God. Sir, here this. Give me the verse 3. Let us look at it together. Did you notice my servant Job? The Lord asked. There is no one on earth as faithful and good as he is. He worships me and is careful not to do anything evil. You persuaded me to let you attack him for no reason at all. But Job is still as faithful as ever. Wait. Do you know the same way you are praying now? Do you know native daughter that is when they are praying to God? I want us to look at this thing. Do nothing evil, yeah? Yes, sir. Hear yeah, me? You persuaded me, me to let you to attack, let you him, attack him, him for no reason. For no reason. You may not do anything before they come for you. You may not do anything wrong before they come for you. Now look at you persuaded me to let, to you, let attack you attack him, attack him for, for no, no reason. reason. Now, even Satan, they pray to God and God they answer him. What do, you, what do you mean by persuading him? You press, you continue asking me. Yes, you continue pushing me that I should do this for you. What is the connection between Satan and God? The same way you are praying to God, that is the way the devil is praying to God. Yes, sir. The same way you are praying to God, that is how native doctors are praying to God. The same way you are praying to God, that is how he makes people are praying to God. He said, you persuaded me to let you at Attack him for no reason. No reason. And still yet. Job is still as faithful as ever. Job is still as faithful as ever. ever. How many of you can God be post of this for you? There are so many of you here. God has been faithful with you before now. God has been doing this for you. Yes, but immediately a little temptation comes. You turn your back on God. Hey. You thank God. If God is God, why this thing happen to me? Hey. If God is God, hey. why did my child die? Hey. If God is God, hey. why did I lose my business? Hey. If God is God, hey. why did I lose my position? Hey. If God is God, hey. why did I lose my lesson? Hey. If God is God, why did I lose my children? So hear me. Before your next level, there must be a next devil. That's, That's all. all. Your next level will never come if there is no next devil. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There is no miracle without a temptation. It is a temptation that makes the miracle miracle. Oh. Yes, sir. Miracle means mystery. Yes, sir. If you look at your life, where you are coming from, you could have been giving glory to God. You will know that God has done something for you. Yes, sir. If God is not saying anything about you now, you should still be grateful to him because he has been saying something concerning you now before yes, now. Yes, sir. He 
if God has not given you anything now, you are still supposed to be grateful because he has given you something before now. Do you, not, do you remember when you are still jobless? Do you remember when there is nothing in your hand? Do you remember when your cloth was here? You were borrowing cloth to wear. Do you remember? Do you remember when you borrow my to put in the soup? Do you remember when things are very tough with you? Hey. But still yet, God still come through for you. Yes, you did not die, but he still give you life. Yes, you did not go down, he still give you an opportunity yes, to still be among the living. Hey. God has done something for you. Yes, sir. He said, appreciation is an application for me. Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, sir. If you are not grateful, you will become a grateful. That's all. Sir, People forget where they are coming from. That is where. They, that is why they don't know where they are going to. Yes, sir. Is it still yet? Still but yet. as you do all this to him, see yet God job is still faithful as ever. ever. As ever. Ah, uh, do you know what job? Job pastor sir. When they talk about Satan, Satan is a heartless being that delights joy in putting pain in the life of believers. Yes, sir. When I talk about Satan, Satan is a heartless being that delights joy in putting pain in the life of a believer. Yes, sir. Look at verse 4. Give me verse 4. Satan replied, Satan replied a person will, a give, person up will give up everything, everything in, order in order to stay, to alive. stay alive. Yes, sir. Satan is the one talking to you. Yes, sir. The same way as you are feeling pain in your body now, you are ready to do anything. Anywhere you can go to, even native doctor, the direct you go to, you can go to. Mm. Anywhere you can go to, you are ready to go. You are thinking that all freedom are freedom. All freedom are not freedom. Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, sir. But now, suppose you hurt his body, he will curse you to your face. Satan is the one talking to God. Though. Yes, sir. He says, suppose you hurt his body, he will curse you to his to your face. Okay. Six. Six. So the Lord said to Satan, All right, he is in your power, but you are not to kill him. Do you hear that? Yes, sir. The Lord, he didn't say, did he say me, say to him. No, sir. No, sir. God is God and Satan communicating. No. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, sir. For your matter. Hey. For your matter. For your matter. The reason why you have not died, because God has not given up your life. Yes, sir. The reason why they have not succeeded to kill you is because God did not approve your death. But God approved all the temptation to test how faithful you are. Yes, sir. Look at the story of Job. Say, so the Lord say unto Satan. To Satan. All right. All right. He is in your power. He is in your power. But you are not to kill him. But you are not to kill him. Yes, sir. Verse 7. seven. Then Satan left the Lord's presence and made sores break out all over Job's body. And then set and leave the presence of God. Yes, sir. And make sure all over the injury, mm. kidney failure, cancer, affliction of all kinds all over your body. After Satan afflicted him, look at what he said all over your body. Yes, sir. That means no place is remaining. No, sir. All the bodies are afflicted. Oh. Verse eight. Last eight. Job went and sat by the garbage dump and took a piece of broken pottery to scrape his sores. Okay? Job nice. was scraping his sores. That means the thing was crushing him. Yes, sir. Now, wait. Nice. Verse 9. His wife said to him, you are still as faithful as ever, aren't you? Why don't you curse God and die? This is our problem. This is our problem as a man. This is our problem. Sir, Anytime you want to take a destiny decision, don't carry your wife among. Something happened two years ago. I want to do some prayer for a man. And I asked him to come to my house. Then I was still living in the railway. And immediately they opened the gate. And when he opened the gate for the man, the man came in with his wife, hold his hand in his hand, coming to my palo for me to do the prayer for him. Immediately I know that this man is not serious. I did not do the prayer. Why did I say that? There are some actions you cannot take when your wife is there. Yes, sir. If your wife is there, your wife must caution you and to discourage you. Job was still faithful. As ever. As ever. But the wife come. You know what the wife told him? 
He said, Cause God now and die. Because there is no evidence, there is nothing coming out of you again. Whether you like it or not. Oh. Out of 100 women, now only two, go still see something coming out of you when you have fall from the up to the ground. The remaining 98 we tell 99, I mean 98, we tell you that there is nothing good coming out of you again. That you are a useless and stupid man. Hey. I am telling you the fact today. Whether you take it or you leave it, I'm telling you the bitter truth. Women are moved by what they see. When they are no longer seeing, they, can, they cannot be moved. Yes, sir. They are moved by the alert you show them. They are moved by the gift you buy for them. Yes, sir. Are you aware that if, you're, if, you're not, wait, if your wife posts picture, you don't comment, you know that is a problem. Because they are moved by what they see. That type, when you go, that, that this is my lovely wife. It means like two billion to them. I love you as a test message, mean 10 billion. But men are thinking of how to get a physical cash. Sure. Am I talking to you now? Yes, sir. Okay. Job lost everything that is still faithful. The body was coated with soul. He's still faithful. And the wife said, Cause God died and died. Job said, No. There was a time I was healthy, there was a time I was doing well. There was a time this was very okay with me. Yes, sir. So if it is God that gave me all that before, God can still give me again. Yes, sir. His wife said to him, You are still as faithful as ever, aren't you? Why don't you curse God and die? That means the wife have already concluded that the wife, the husband will die. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. By the sickness. Verse 10. Yes, sir. Job answered, You are talking nonsense. Hey! Job, answer the wife. Yes, sir. You are talking nonsense. nonsense. Am I the one that says it? No, sir. Some of you cannot answer the kind of answer. And you call yourself a man, no. You cannot say, keep quiet for that thing when you the talk. Your wife will tell you what you will give to God. Your wife will tell you. Hey, wait still to me. Have you aware that anytime you want to give a, a gift to God or you want to support the work of God, your wife will remember you of the children's school fees you never pay. Yes, sir. Now, look at what Job answered. Uh, Job answer. You are talking, you are talking nonsense. nonsense. When God sends us something good, we welcome it. How can we complain when he sends us trouble? Even in all this suffering, Job said nothing against God. Who is here that can tell me that God has not given something good? Who can raise up his hand? Who is here that God has not given something good? Look at what Job answered. Job, Job answered. You, you are, are talking, talking nonsense. nonsense. When God sent us something good, something good we, we welcome, welcome it. it. How can we complain when he sends us trouble? Even in all this suffering, Job said nothing against God. When he sent you an appointment letter, you were jubilating. You welcome it. You are shouting hallelujah. When you win a lesson, you are shouting, hallelujah. When they give you a new job, you are shouting, hallelujah. When they give you a new husband, you are shouting, hallelujah. Mm. When you get a credit alert, you are shouting, hallelujah. But immediately a little disappointment comes. You are not complaining. Why me? Why be saying that me? Why be saying that me? Open all the prayer. Why don't pray? Ah, why be say it happen? That means that church is not working again. God is the one handling your matter, not be church. Yes, that's sir. all. On all the temptation, Job did not say anything God. against God. Yes, sir. Look at this. Then now, what? What is the last paragraph there? The last if, two paragraphs. Even in all this suffering. Even in all this suffering, Job said nothing against God. God, we are like you. God, we are like you. If you don't answer me now, I will not go to church again. When you go to church, you don't go to church. Who tell you say God is care about whether you go to church? Mm. When I nearly start ministry that time, some people will come to church. When I will locate them, they will say, Ah, man of God, I pray, I pray that today, if you do not locate me, eh, I will know that you are not a real man of God. How did your problem validate or authentify my calling? Oh. Whether I locate you or not locate you, I'm a real man of God by calling. That's all. So it is not your problem that validated, that validated me. 
It's not your problem now. Identify me. Yes, sir. That is a carnal statement. Very carnal. Man of, God, man of God, I pray today when I enter the church, I say it is a real man of God. Make it locate me. Holy God, fire. I prophesy with capital letter. That's, That's all. all. Capital letter. You don't want God to ransom. You don't want God to ransom. God do things when you want to do it. God answer when you want to answer. Yes, sir. But the prophetic can intervene on your behalf and command what about to happen in 10 years' time to happen now. Oh. Yes, sir. That is by the calling of the prophet. Yes, yes sir. sir. If he's a real prophet. Elijah said, if I be a man of God, by this time tomorrow, there will be an abundance in the land. Mm. And the man was standing in the gate and doubting. And he said, you will see it, but you will not test of it. That is a gift. Elijah did not say by the word of God. Though. He said by my word. Oh, yes, sir. yes, sir. Hear this. If you are not strong now, if you are not strong, if you do not put on your armor, if you do not stand firm, the devil now not be devil of before. No, sir. Devil of now, Satan of now, they are on Twitter, they have Facebook handle, they have Instagram handle. Yes, I am sir. telling you the fact now. Yes, sir. So you must put on all your instruments. You get where you reach in life. Your heart needs to be strong. You need to withstand anything that comes up your way. Job did not fear. Job did not fall. Job did not look back. Of his weight. Anything you are passing through now is temporary. Mm. It will still come and go. He said, and it shall come. Your problem is not permanent. Go allow that problem for a season. If you are sick, that sickness will not kill you. If that sickness will kill you, it will have killed you before now. Allow it for a reason. So many people deny God in the days of their trouble because they don't know the God they are serving. Yes, sir. Man goes, oh, to that means if your God, he said, show me the size of your God. He says it's big. If your God is big, what is a headache that God cannot take? What is a cancer that God cannot take? What is a liver issue that God cannot take? He said, That means my God is big. If my God is big, the sickness is too small for my God to ask. Yes, sir. Disappointment is too small. Backwardness is too small. Sadness is too small. Humiliation is too small. No matter what happens around you, sir, if you have God with you, sir, it is the era of prayer. Era of prayer and power. And power cannot come without prayer. Never. Power cannot come without sacrifice. No, sir. If you don't have power, powers will realize you. Yes, sir. Oh, you think is this life is just uh, fried rice and chicken? Wake up from that sleep. We are in the era of power. You can't speak a word to butterfly and butterfly fly. Even your guy to God, God know the answer. You know that you have lost your authority as a man. He said, have dominion upon all the cricketing on the earth. Is that yes, what, the, what God said to Adam? He said, if you will uh, leave this thing to me now. But you, you said to God, God, hey, you there. God is still chopping your teeth. You know that something is wrong with your spiritual life. Something is wrong with you. Something is wrong with you. Something is wrong with you. Don't blame God when things are going wrong with you. Because God is preparing you for your next level. In every level you are, there is a challenge that will come from Satan yes, towards your life and towards yes. your children. God is watching you. What you will say and what you will do. If what you say is in the sight of God, if what you do is in the benefit of God, God must surely deliver you. But if what you say is against God, if what you do is against God, God will allow the temptation to swallow you. In the days of trouble, that is where we know the believers. In the time of trouble, that is where we know the faithfulness of you. You don't know believers by when they buy new cars. You don't know believers when God give them husband. You don't know believers by when God give them a new job. You know believers. By that time, when everything is upside down. was turning upside down, yes, sir. that is when you know believers. That is when you know faithfulness of men. Yes, sir. That is when you know a true believer. Mm. Three of Job's friends were Eliphaz from the city of Teman, Bildad from the land of Shua, and Zophar from the land of Nama. When they heard how much Job had been suffering, they decided to go and confront him. While they were still 
a long way off. They saw Job, but did not recognize him. When they did, they began to weep and wail, tearing their clothes in grief and throwing dust into the air and on their heads. Amen. Even when the friend of Job that were going towards Job, they could not recognize him. Yes. Because everything was upside down. But Job still maintained his faithfulness. Yes, sir. Job is still an upright man. He still there knowing God and serving God. And God restored everything that Job lost in his life. Yes, sir. That is too back to him. Yes. He said, for the delay, I will restore double. Yes. Can I tell you? As you wait upon the Lord, yeah. the Lord will not just restore, yes, but He will restore double yeah, of man. what the enemy has stolen yeah, out man. of your life. Yeah, they man. may come like a flood, yeah, but the Lord will raise up a standard yeah, against them. Yeah, they may come against you in the one way, yeah, by seven ways they will scatter. He yeah, said, Surely they will gather, yeah, but if they gather in front of Him, they will surely scatter. Yeah, Can I hear your amen like a thunder? Yeah. As you shout, amen, my God will restore your life. Hey, hey. Ephesians 6 verse 10. The reason why you must be strong. Let me prove it to you. Ephesians 6 verse 10. Ephesians 16. Finally, build up your strength in union with the Lord and by means of his might, of his mighty power. Put on all the armor that God gives you so that you will be able to stand up against the devil's evil tricks. For we are not fighting against human beings, but against the wicked spiritual forces in the heavenly world, the rulers, authorities, and cosmic powers of this dark age. So put on God's armor now. Then, then when the evil days come, you will be able to resist the enemy's attack. And after fighting to the end, you will still hold your ground. It's 14. He said, after fighting to the end, you will yes, still hold, hold your, your ground. ground. Because of the armor you have put it on. Yes, sir. The armor, what is the armor? Is the word of God. Yes, sir. So stand ready with truth as a belt tight around your waist. With righteousness as your breastplate. 15. And as your shoes, the readiness to announce the good news of peace. Peace, your shoe. Wait, oh, I want to come there for you. Peace is your, is your shoe. Verse 16. 16. At all times, carry faith. As a shield. Faith as what? As a shield. Okay. For with it, you will be able to put out all the burning arrows shot by the evil one. The burning arrow of the evil ones. Yes, okay, verse 17. 17. And accept salvation as a helmet. Salvation as your helmet. Yes, sir. Okay. The word of God as the sword which the spirit gives the you. The word of God as a sword. Yes, sir. Quit the spirit living. 18. 18. Do all this in prayer. Asking for God's help. Pray on every occasion as the Spirit leads. For this reason, keep alert and, and never give up. Pray always for all God's people. Amen. Amen. God is the one telling you to pray always. always. Hear this, sir. A prayerless Christian is a powerless Christian. That's all. When your life is prayerless, your enemy can pray your way out to that destination. Yeah. Because a prayer is an ID card. A prayer is a weapon. Yeah. When you have a prayer background, your back cannot go down. When you have a prayerful life, there are some painful life that you cannot live. Yes, but when you cannot pray, that is where the problem comes from. Yeah. If you cannot pray, yes, the enemy will pray you out. Yes, if you cannot pray, yes. your enemy will poison you. Yes. If you cannot pray, your enemy will bring you down. Yes. Sir, prayer is one thing every mortal is supposed to have in their life. Sir, oh God. When you are asleep, even the the, uh, the Bible tell you that the enemy come to sow evil time. Yes, sir. If you are prayerless, if you are a prayerless person, oh. you don't know what is happening in the night. There are business transactions. There are so many of you here. You don't wake up in the night to pray. Even in your night, in the, your evening prayer before you sleep. When you say prayer is a key, you are already young. You, the sleep will come like an attack. Yeah. Yeah, man. Anytime you want to pray and sleep, calling you is an attack. Mm. 
Some of you pray very well before, but suddenly your prayer like quench because you eat too much. Sure. How can you be in church on Sunday morning and you beg? Ogbono soup they come out of your mouth. On Sunday meeting is supposed to be a day to meet in the presence of God. Yes, to consider what will happen around the week. You are supposed to come with fasting. Are you aware that some pastor go to Sunday meeting and they, are, they have already eaten? It has never happened and it will never happen. How can I say shout fire and my mouth not carry fire? You are in church from Monday to Alako Palaciata. You are in church every day. And when you go to get home, sir, as a wife, you raise up quarry and quarry begin. All your prayer you have prayed for the day of that Sunday have been neutralized by your nagging and headache and everything you give to your husband. When you don't pray, uh, sir, if you create a bush in your land yes, sir. and you refuse to plant anything, Something will go up. Yes, sir. Do you know what will go up? Grass will go up. When you are not prayerful, another person that is very prayerful more than you will pray you take. Mm. If not, how can a Christian be sleeping and somebody will come and press you? Sure. Even a dead liar, if you lie down for God, dog no go cross him. No go near him. Do you know why? Even the look of the lion scared dog. Yes, sir. Dog and lion are not the same. So, so. Sir, put a lion down. Fowl will not near there. Say he don't die. Or put the head of lion down. Fowl will not near there. Yes, Have you ever seen a hot food in a dining table and fry? Go and pitch it. No, sir. No, sir. Because you are too cold. That why anything they throw enters you. In this end time, you are so empty. So carnal. You are more on Facebook than in your, in your, in your life. Sure. Your battery is more full than your spiritual life battery. Oh. You charge your phone every day. And your spiritual life is in a low bar. 0.00%. As a wife, you are not prayerful. So, I tell you, if your husband fall down in your heart, as a wife, you are a failure. You are a failure. It's not only enough for you to pray, say, let me marry. I want to get married. After getting married, there's another prayer you need to pray. Yes, sir. My husband must not fail. See, the motherhood of your husband transferred to you as a wife. Yes, sir. You become a mother, a sister, and everything to your husband. And if you look at we spiritual eye very well, in village people, they, 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 they romance up very well. And when preaching is going on that you can be free, you are sleeping. When enemy capture you out of the word of God, they will give you their own word. They will give you their own word. There is an excuse. Oh, everything you do in life, there is an excuse. When you are asleep, there is an excuse. When you are not in church early, it's an excuse. It's not a room for, or hold up, hold, hold on, or there is no light for you to iron your coat. But when you are sick, there will be no excuse for them to rush you to hospital. Sir, if you know buckle your shoe where this era we are now, devil is not smiling. No. Devil is walking 24 hours round the clock. Now before, now they don't say, uh, which they suck blood in here. They know they suck blood in here again. Then they check blood. Then they carry blood now to lab. Go check out. They won't wake a HIV and they won't wake a HIV. Before they suck now. They don't suck. They don't suck any other. They look the one way they want suck. So even, even them, they don't upgrade. They will not upgrade. That is why you can be working with your phone, waiting consign them with your phone. But they know when money want to come and when money will not want to come. You are expecting a fire. They know when the fire is coming. You are expecting a credit alert. They know when the alert is coming. So they are too digital now to even know when alert is coming to your phone. And you, you are still backward. In all the time you are supposed to be praying. When one of your child is behaving the way you don't like, see that God bless you. Behaving the way you don't like, go down on your knee. You say this is not what God promised me. I command your brain to be normalized. When one of your child is behaving at normal, speak in tongue. Command their life to be restructured. When one of your daughter is going wayward, speak in tongue. I command their life to be normalized. Yes, sir. When you are there, you are not speaking any word. The heaven and the earth was created by what God bless you see that was created by the word. So, word is the one that rules the world. If you cannot speak any word, the enemy will speak a word on your behalf. The earlier you speak, the better for you. Yes, sir. 
as a mother, another woman is dealing with your children. You are a fool. Instead of you to rise up and say, I did not give my daughter or my son to anybody to kill. You are not praying. You are not saying anything. You look like the way you see it. In the morning, you eat fried rice. Afternoon, you eat a bar. Evening, you eat fufu. You think life don't finish. Every day of your life, they are telling you you are getting fat or you are smiling. You think fat is an achievement. Mm. So can I joke you? Fat is the evidence of you getting close to your grave. Oh, yeah. You better keep yourself fit. Keep yourself fit. See, fasting helps you not only spiritual. It helps you physical. Yes, sir. To get you fit and to keep, keep you fit. When you are fasting 24 hours, sir, your stomach will be getting flatter because nothing is going inside. Yes, sir. Every day you are eating. Every day as a young boy, things are not going well to do. Go into fasting. Go into fasting. Sometimes prophecy may not hit you, but pick yourself a prophecy. Yes, sir. Pick yourself for prophecy. Don't wait for prophecy. Give yourself prophecy. I will not fail this year. It depends on what you do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I will not fall down this year. It depends on what you do. Yes, sir. As a young girl, in under the sound of my voice here, if all your goal in life is iPhone 14 Pro Max, iPhone 15, iPhone 16 will still come out now. You are targeting how you will buy it. Ah. This is when the devil is not smiling. Boys are not smiling. You will not be the next victim. Amen. See, the main purpose of phone is to communicate. Immediately your phone can communicate. You are good to go. You must not use 16 Pro Max or 17 Pro Max or 19 Pro Max. You, your phone gets three cameras and your two eyes. You cannot still use it to see. Oh, yeah. Your eye is not working well. Have you taken note that the, the real successful women that make money by themselves, they don't dress well. Have you taken note that the women that make money for themselves, that really make money, that they are the ones hustling for the money, they don't have time for dressing. Eh? Yes, but in those ones, where do they give money? All those guys, where we say that somebody they fund them, and then you go see, wait, if they wake up in the morning, they go spend one hour, they make up their face, two hours, they make up their hair, five hours, they dress up because they don't have any job, they are jobless. Mm. But when you see people that hustle for money, have you not seen people with low cut? Yes, sir. Ladies with low cut, you will see that they don't have time to go and pray there. Because in the money, on Monday morning, they are in the place carrying their goods. On Tuesday morning, they are in the shop arranging their goods. On Wednesday, they are, they are, they are, they are, they are writing their goods in their, in, in their sales book. They don't have time. But I don't know whether they give money. So, they the church here. When you see them in the church, you go see two listic. One go day up, one go day down. They only they get black and red and purple for one mouth. Hey. One mouth get three lipstick. Where you they go? Yeah. And single prayer you cannot pray. Prayer you cannot pray. Nothing is. See if things is not working for you, pray your way out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Men, go and check the definition of handsome. Handsomeness is a is a man with good looking and a man with substantial number of cash in his hand. Yes, go sir. and check the definition of. But you think it's to keep BS and maintain BS. That is, sir, build your spiritual life. Everybody is using something. Depends what you are using. That's all. Make sure what you are using is good. Yes, sir. But you are here every day. They teach you how to pray. You cannot still pray. In the morning, you fold your hand. In the night, you fold your hand. You are pressing your phone. And you cannot command the principalities that control the earth and the heaven to, to obey your voice. Okay, do you think I will eat every day? Then I will come and say, devil, in the name of Jesus, the person will manifest as, as they manifest what they see. You think it's honorary? Oh, sir. Go and blow, please. Go blow. There is a volume of capacity you must carry in your stomach. Ah, yeah. It's the act of that belly shall flow at the rivers of living waters. Oh, what did your belly carry? Mm. Is it for an eba? eba? It's the act of that belly that flow rivers of living water. What is in your stomach? Is it the jealousy or the envy? Hey. When you see somebody that testify before you, you begin to say, ah, but I was me, I was in this church before this person. Why must he testify? Because you are not serious. God does not look how long he look how far. Yes, sir. How well. How well. Your authentication, that's what God look. Yes, sir. Your heart, that is what God look. Yes, sir. You can be in place for 10 years and somebody come one day and take what you have never taken. Yes, sir. Because of the kind of heart you have. The kind of behavior you have. Job did not give up in his life. 
Job did not say, where is God? Job did not say, I will not serve God again. Job did not say, I will go back on God. Job followed God to the end. And God looked at his faithfulness and restored everything that the devil has taken away from him. But I want to tell you today, no matter what you are passing through, don't ever give up on God. Because God is still alive. He's the same God yesterday. The same God today yes. and the same God forever. Yes, He's the God who blessed you before. Yes, he will still bless you again. Yes. It is the same God who will lift you up before. Yes, he will still lift you up again. Yes, the enemy may come against you yes. but the Lord is with you. Yes, the enemy may come against your work. Yes, the Lord is with you. Yes, the enemy may come against your children yes, but the Lord is with them. Yes, the enemy may come against your ministry yes, but the Lord is with them. Yes, if I hear somebody End of you yes. that your amen is in ladders yes. before the end of this meeting. Yes. What the enemy has taken in your life, yes. that will be restored back to you. Yes. That will be restored back to you. Yes. That will be restored back to you. Yes. Can you lift up your hand as a fire? Yes. Hey. Hear this. Yes, sir. Nothing could come easy. Nothing. Nothing good. God. Easy. Without tears, there is no joy. No, sir. For a mother that enter labor room, she must cry. Yes, sir. A woman that is pregnant, we tell a, a daughter. Is a daughter? Why my labor have not started? And the daughter sometimes induce them for their labor to stand. Yes, sir. Do you know what it means? Let me educate you on that. Yes, sir. The woman actually go and meet the daughter. Yes. Say, daughter, why am I not in pain? Why? Am I talking to you? Yes, sir. So, doctor will induce them for the pain to come. The, for the pain to come. Yes, Can I let you know something? Talk to me, sir. Then after the pain of two hours, yes, sir. when the mother gives back to the child, hey. the mother will still put ear on ground. Yes, Whether the child will cry. Hey. That is the tears of the child. Hey. Is the joy of the mother. Yes, Yet there is no tears. Hey. There will be no joy. Yes, so tears come before joy. Yes, you must shed tears without a process of gold. Yes. Go still remain the dead. Yes. Before you can enjoy life, yes. there is a process you must pass through. Yes, sir. If you hear, say, I hear. I hear you, sir. Are you aware that all pregnant women here will be angry when their baby is not kicking in their womb? Yes, yes sir. The baby is kicking them, is spelling them. But they are happy that the baby is kicking them. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, sir. Oh, mothers, when the baby is kicking, is it not paining you? It pain you, but you are happy that the baby is kicking you. For you to be sure that the baby is alive. That means anytime you are fighting, there is an assurance of joy. Yes, sir. When a pregnant woman did not feed the baby kicking for a day, she will rush to a midwife or a laboratory yes, or a hospital yes, and she will ask the doctor, I have not feed my baby kicking. Hey. What it means is that yes, my baby has not punched me. Hey. My baby has not kicked me. Hey. My baby has not kicked me. Yes. He has not gnawed me. Hey. He, what it means is that he's telling the doctor, why my baby never heard me. Hey. When the devil is hurting you, mm. kicking you, yes, sir. and punching you, yes, sir. know that after nine months, hey. you will give back. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. After the baby bed, hey. you will carry your baby. Yes, sir. And people will be gathering in your house. Yes, sir. When the devil is not in you now, hey. he feels his first matter. Yes, he feels his toes as a matter. Yes, sir. That is too intelligent. Yes, but I want to let you know yes, that after nine months, yes, after Hey, your nine months just arrived today. Hey, Whatever hey. thing the devil has been doing to you, it come to an end today. Hey, it come to an end today. Hey, it come to an end today. Hey, you come to an end today. Hey, your level must change. Hey, hey. Yes, sir. Don't ever think that you will be promoted without an examination. Yes, sir. No sir. way. I'm not talking to you. Yes, sir. yes, sir. Don't ever think in life. Don't you ever. That you will be promoted without an examination. You cannot go from primary one to primary two without an exam. No way. No way. There is no way you want to boycott it. Is there any way? 
No, sir. You cannot go from SS1 mm. to SS2 without examination. No, sir. Never. Examination means that you must read, you must study, and in the morning you will go and practice what you have read. Yes, sir. The same way as I'm talking to you now. You have come to study today. Yes, sir. After you go back. Sir, you are not supposed to be in this level. It's because you do not know the philosophy behind the word. The word is not smiling. I preach a message here and I say, I am not a tree. Yes, sir. It's only a tree that stands in one place and the motor man will go around it and say, let us cut it from here. Let us cut it from here and the tree will be quiet. No reaction from the tree. The tree will be quiet. And the motor will put it inside. It's still cutting. The tree will still be quiet. quiet. And then it's like the motor saw that read the tree to fall. That is where the tree will fall. I, I am not a tree. I am not a tree. I will not fall to where my enemy direct me to. No, sir. Never. The prayer of my enemy will never come past him, come to pass in my life. Never. Yes, sir. I know the place I stand. Mm. In Christ. I am in Christ. I can't be in crisis. Yes, sir. Know this for yourself now. Sir, nobody will help you unless you help yourself. That's yes, all. Sir. Yes, sir. Pray without season. This life is winning by the people that know their stand in Christ. If you don't want to be in crisis, be in Christ. If you want to be in crisis, don't be in Christ. Yes, sir. If you want to be in a place of enjoyment and in a place of peace, be in Christ. Christ is the truth, the way, and the life. Without Christ, nothing work. Without Christ, nothing stand. Without Christ, nothing work. Nothing. Under the sound of my voice, and inside you, there is no Christ in you. Ah. You better rise up now, as I'm about to call for the call of Christ. For your own good. Because there is no miracle that can be sustained without Christ in you. Yes, sir. That is the foundation of you to be strong in the Lord. That is the foundation of you to, to be well in the word of God. For, for he said, faith coming by hearing and the word hearing of the word of God. God. If you have not known Christ under the sound of my voice, now is an opportunity for you. In the next two minutes, I will call for you. Those people that want me to lay hand on them, to welcome you and to shake you, to welcome you to this wonderful peace, to this wonderful home. To become a candidate of heaven by faith and by the hearing of the word of God. If you are here under the sound of my voice and you have not genuinely given your life to Christ, come back quickly. I want to have a handshake with you. God love you and heaven love you. I want to pray with you now. For your prayer not to be hindered today. I want to shake you and to pray with you. By the count of three, I expect you to come out. Don't look at your neighbor and don't look at your friend. Jesus loves you and God is waiting here for you. One, two, three. Parted for the water so my soul longing after thee. When you That your boyfriend will leave you. The only boyfriend that will not disappoint you is Jesus. Yes, sir. The only husband that will not fail you is Jesus. Yes, sir. And the only father that will not abandon you is Jesus. Yes, sir. The only mother that will not fail you is Jesus. Yes, sir. Upon all the boyfriend you have gotten, what have you achieved? He said, go ye to me, oh ye that is labor and heavy laden, and I will give you the rest. He said, the name of the Lord is a strong tower, and the righteous run unto it, and they are saved. That's all. I'm back, oh. I'm back to you, oh Lord. You have been calling me to come back. And I'm back to you, finally. Motic Life be so funny that we cannot understand. 
We live today, tomorrow we die. What, what is, is the meaning of, of life? life? This might be the last chance I save Jesus today. Tomorrow may be too late for you. What, what is, is the meaning of, of life? I'm back. I'm back, back to you all. You have been calling me to come back. And I'm back to you. Lay hand on your head. Say, Lord Jesus. Jesus. I come unto you today. I come unto you, you today. today. Accept me. Accept me. I am convinced today. I am convinced today that you died for my sake. That you died for my sake. That you died because of my sin. You died because of my sin. Come into my life. Come into my life. Be my Lord and personal Be Savior. Be my Lord and personal Savior. And I make a vow today. And I make a vow today. I will never go back to my past. I will never go back to my past. I will live a life for you. I will live a life for you. And live this life for you. And live this life for you. Come and be my Lord and personal Savior. Come and be my Lord and personal Savior. Now and forevermore. Now and forevermore. In Jesus' name. Amen. Congratulations to you. All of you that have prayed this prayer, I want to pray for you. May the air mark of the enemy never be found in your life again. Amen. Your prayer today will be answered in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. You can go back to your seat. Thank you. Your prayer this afternoon. Yes, sir. Oh Lord, help me to know you more. Oh Lord, help me to know you more. Oh Lord, help me to know you more. Lord, help me. Lift up your hands and say, My Father. My Father. Help me to know you more. Help me to know you more. Open your mouth and pray for two minutes. My Father, my God. Help me to know you more. We are going to pray to God. Help us to know you. Help me to know you more. Better than the way we know you. Help me to know you more. Lord, we want to know you more. We want to know you deeper than we know you. Help me to know you more. Oh God, your word said the deep collect unto the deep. Thank Father, you, Abba, help Father. Father help more. us. Help us. Lord, help me to know you more. That I might know Lord, you. Lord, help me to know you more. And the power of your might. Thank you, O oh God. Father. Yes, Lord. Before the area of your miraculous. Yes, sir. Is it not that your hand is too broke or your, your, your short or your ear is too broke? But the sin and iniquity of your children cost you the accurate. Father, every one of them standing before you here. Yes, Lord. That need your light and your touch today. Mm. Father, visit them. Amen. Amen. Let every darkness in their life free away from their life. Amen. And I decree to 98 of them. Yes, sir. Anyone here that the enemy has hooked captain yes, by enchantment or by, or by projection, Holy I God. command let that child return back to center. Amen. Amen. Anyone here that they have been deprived you of what belongs to you. I enter my office as an oracle of God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I decree to 78 of you. Yes, yes, sir. In the next 24 hours. Yes, yes sir. sir. Any pursuer of your destiny, pursuer of your life, pursuer of your children's life, as your amen is a higher seven times, they go down. Summon you for evil. Yes, Let thunder arise for your sake. Yes, Let the angel of God arise for your sake. Yes, Anywhere they summon you for disaster. Yes, Let the angel of the Lord appear for your sake. Yes, if you shout that amen louder, you are the one I just picked up. Yes, if you shout it louder, you are the one I just picked up. Yes, May heaven deliver you. Yes, May the angel of the Lord appear for your sake. Yes, Can you shout that amen loud? Yes, Whatever thing you need for this year to be successful, Jesus. before the end of this meeting, I said, carry it over. Yeah. I said, carry them 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 over. Yeah. Yeah. In Jesus' name, I pray. Yeah. This is my soul.